In my very last video, I explained why you should be bidding on your brand's name on Google Ads in order to maximize your revenue, maximize your traffic, and increase your brand reputation. So in this video, I'm gonna go against everything I said in the last video and explain the specific circumstances of why you shouldn't be bidding on your brand's name. So you're gonna learn all of that and more coming up. Hey guys, Darren Taylor of TheBigMarketer.com and my job is to make you a better marketer. Now, if that sounds up your street, you should consider subscribing to my channel. And in this video, we are explaining why when it comes to Google Ads PPC, you should not be bidding on your brand name. So let's jump right into it and go into the reason number one of why you shouldn't be bidding on your brand name. The first reason you shouldn't be bidding on your brand name is because you're limited by your budget. So of course, as I mentioned in the last video, Brand clicks are cheaper, so you might think to yourself, why are you telling me not to bid on my brand name if I'm restricted by budget? Well, let me tell you why. Because if you're looking to engage people who have never heard of your business before in order for them to discover you and book your services, which is most of marketing, to be fair, on the page search results, is people you've never heard of before, and they're bidding to appear there as an advert so you can take on their service, that is the reason why you shouldn't bid on your brand name and use all of your budget on your brand because the keywords with the intents of people looking for a specific service are really high converting keywords that bring new customers to your business as opposed to returning customers. There's always a risk when bidding on your brand name that returning customers or people who are already working with you, who already know who you are, will click the advert, bring up your PPC costs, and in the end, if you're restricted by budget, that can eat your budget in the wrong type of way. You want to spend your budget on the terms that are bringing new business into you. The next reason you shouldn't bid on your brand's name is a much harder reason to detect, and that is because it can potentially cannibalize your organic search result clicks anyway. So what I mean by that is, imagine you have no advert for your business running at all, you only have your organic listing, people are clicking that when they type your brand in because that's the only listing on the search results that matches exactly with your brand. Now imagine you turn on a paid search campaign bidding on your brand's term. What can happen is that you'll see a significant drop in your organic results because people are finding you through the paid results. Now, that's not necessarily a bad thing if people are bidding on your brand as well because you're protecting your brand, but if nobody's bidding on your brand and people are clicking your ad and it's cannibalizing your organic results, then you're spending money for nothing. Be sure to check, make sure no one is bidding on your brand's name. If no one's bidding on your brand name, you can be pretty safe knowing that if you bid on it, you're gonna be wasting your money because people will just find you in the organic listings. And if you're not caring about vanity, which I mentioned in the last video, of having an air of authority by bidding on your brand, as well as having your organic listing on the page as well, then it doesn't matter. If you're focused on a budget and you're focused on maximizing your revenue and you don't care about the authority you get from doing that, then don't bid on your brand in this scenario. And that ties into the final reason why you shouldn't be bidding on your brand name. And that is, if no competitors are bidding on your brand name, then why bother anyway? And as I mentioned, you might want to have the look of authority of people seeing you're bidding on your own brand name and being out there on the search results page, but is there any other reason to bid if no one else is bidding on your brand name? You're not protecting anything. You're not pushing people out or freezing out your competitors by driving up the CPC for brand terms. There's no need to protect anything because there's nothing to protect. And if you're a small business operating on a budget, it doesn't make sense to bid on your brand name in that scenario. Now, what you'll find is a lot of large businesses spend tons and tons and tons of money bidding on their brand because they actually care about that authority. In my last video, I mentioned Mercedes-Benz. Now, of course, they're a massive global business with a massive household brand name, and they can afford to do that, and it looks authoritative when Mercedes-Benz bid on their brand name. Now, if you're a small, you know, mum and pa business with a small budget, then it doesn't make sense to try and look like you're authoritative. Focus on the terms that will drive new business into you. If any agencies or anybody says you should bid on your brand name, regardless then question them with the knowledge in this video you shouldn't bid on your brand name regardless there are definitely some positives to doing it but you've got to make sure it fits in with your business and the position your business is in Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, please leave a like below. Hopefully you've watched both videos on the subject. You've watched why you should bid on your brand. This video obviously covered why you shouldn't bid on your brand. Let me know in the comments what side you're on in terms of your business and the business you work within, whether or not you should bid on your brand yourself. 
I reply to pretty much every single comment I get on YouTube and on LinkedIn. So hit me up in the comments below. I'll be more than happy to discuss everything with you down there. More important than that, don't forget to subscribe, check out the other content on my channel, and I'll see you guys on my next video.